She was so smart and her numbers, her colors, her letters, um, she was getting all of that. But she just didn't want to sit down and do the work. So there's the name, I would write it down and I scribbled over everything. I didn't know what to do. Hi, my name is Allison Jane Fournier. <laughs> You know, what is the issue? Is it that we're just squirrely and we're just not quite ready for what, you know, the teacher is asking? Or is it that, you know, there's something else? The instructions were just kind of like a big blur. Sometimes vision issues can, you know, show themselves in just not wanting to be a part of what we're doing. I bet they thought that I just didn't really want to do my work, but Mrs. Castle, she saw beyond that and she knew that I needed glasses. I just said, what do you think about maybe having her eyes checked? Maddie, well, her teachers had commented that she would sometimes just get up out of her desk and go look really closely at the whiteboard at school. Hi, my name is Maddie, I'm 11 years old. <laughs> I kind of thought everybody thought the board was blurry, so I'm not sure if I saw much of anything. Maddie has always been very into books and reading and language, and Allison never really enjoyed sitting still. She was more into let's be outside, play. We just thought that's who they are. The thought didn't occur to me that it might be vision related until they were in school. How long have you guys been sisters? <laughs> um, as long as Allie's years. Yeah, as long as Allie's been alive. <laughs> oh, it broke my heart. We come out of the doctor's office and she's wearing her glasses and she goes, Mommy, can you see those mountains right there? You can see Mount Chasta. It's pretty much right outside the window. We've lived here for five years and you couldn't see the mountain that was right outside. As it turns out, yeah, she can't see. <laughs> but she didn't know. I think that once the glasses were there and she was able to see, put it all together in the package, then she had that sense of accomplishment. I have to read, she has to see far away. Well, Allie needs them for things close up, reading and drawing. And I need them for things far away, which is why I wear mine a lot more often. <laughs> Madeline became a lot more adventurous um, once she could see that the world is not a scary, blurry, unknown place. <laughs> Hello, camera. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> and Allie, once we got her glasses, yeah, it, it changed how she did school, and that was amazing. Because I was confident that I would get good grades. She went from first straight into third. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think the sky's the limit for them. <laughs>